welcome to my youtube channel my name is kate chatari and of course i'm saying hi ladies because lately i've been talking about the things that the women and the ladies need to do and right here on my bed i have all these things that we always put in our handbags i feel there are necessities for every woman to have in their handbags but also you can go ahead and leave your comments down below and tell me what you carry in your bag what have i forgotten tell me let's learn from one another so right here i have with me a bigger bag and i have a really tiny bag over here okay but then my essentials i always feel like every woman's bag should have of course wipes back in the day everybody used to have a hand sanitizer and now i feel like probably it's more for the guys because with uh with wipes you can use them on your face on your hands on your bag on your shoes you know for everything and then of course when you're going to church you need to carry a bible or even maybe on every day. I know a friend of mine that carries a, a Bible every day, daily. It's a he actually. And then this can be a very good size if you, you know, you're a lady out there and you want to carry a Bible with you. And then I have a pair of sunnies in here, sunglasses. Sunglasses are important because when you're living in the tropics like we are doing, you never know, it might get hot, it might get sunny. You always need to have a pair of shades with you. And you always have to have a scarf because it could get windy, it could get cold, and you need to, you know, put it around your waist. Also, it's used as an accessory, you know, to change your outfit. Yes, and of course, not forgetting about a border. Any other time you could get on a border border and you'll need a scarf. And in this day and era, everybody needs a power bank, right? You cannot even move without a power bank. That means that you'll need your charger and, of course, your earphones because we're always in a crowd. You will always have your wallet that has your ATM cards and your national ID and of course a little bit of money, maybe 10k, 5k, you know, the smallest denomination. That brings me to a coin pass. You could have a tiny coin pass that has in your coins. In my part of the country, we have a lot of coins. They range from 500 to 200 to 100 to 50s. <laughs> so you drop them in here. We always get such type of change. And then you always have a lotion, a hand lotion in your bag, a pocket size perfume, some lip gloss or a lipstick, you need a comb, and a notebook. So that means you also have a pen. Look at all this. All this has to fall into the hands of a girl, of a lady, of a woman. And then, of course, you never know when those days come up or even when you need to change. So how are you going to put all these things in your bag? These are necessities. We all need this. So the simplest way that I do it, I always make sure that I separate these because they're very sensitive. You could also decide to put in an extra underwear in here or even a hunky, according to your preference. And then what I usually do, I put the hand lotion, the pocket size perfume, the lip gloss or the lipstick, the comb, the wet wipes in one. And then I zip it. Okay. I zip it. Just like that. There we go. So now that leaves us with a pen and a notebook. What you have to do, you can put your pen on the side so it doesn't leave your notebook. And the rest of these, we're going to put them in a bag. Now this is where you have to make choices, okay? You're going to carry on you're going to carry your tiny bag for the day that you're probably not going to use any of these. You're not going to church. You're not going to take any notes. You're probably meeting up with your girlfriends. You don't need coins. But you need these, right? So what you're going to do, you're going to have your power bank very important you could decide to wear your scarf you can put it over your shoulder depending on your outfit your phone in your bag your wallet your earphones and your charger and then of course you're going to need um, your bag holder you know Ladies, we are done with just going to a restaurant or to a bar and then you just don't have anywhere to put your bag. When you have one of these, you just take it out, 
put place it on top of the table and then you hang there your bag i'm going to show you how you use this later so now you are going to use your perfume all over you make sure you wear enough lip gloss because i mean you're going out for a few hours okay so all this will not count for the part of the day we are going to leave that case behind and you could put your sunnies either on your face or on top of your hand. and we are ready to go ladies all these things are now on me and I still have them with me shall we go out? I'm ready <laughs> So now, this is a different activity. You have a bigger bag and you can afford to carry everything in your bag. Remember, we talked about always separating the lotion from the, and the lip gloss and your pocket size perfume, not forgetting your comb. Those will have to go in one tiny pouch. Okay, these will go together. Zip that up. The bigger one always has to go in the bigger bag first. Okay. There we go. Very important, yeah? Your sanitaries, probably your tampon, your Bible, your notebook and pen, your coin case, your power bank, your wallet and ATM cards, your charger and your earphones, your scarf. The best way to do it is to roll it around, push it in like a donut, in your bag. Everything is in there. And you're ready to go so i hope you ladies know how to keep your essentials in your handbag and of course if i did forget about anything just go down below in the comment section and leave a comment but if you also like the video don't forget to give me a thumbs up and also subscribe until next time bye ladies